4X, 4X, everything get 4X. <laughs> What's going on everybody? As always, it's a blessing to be here. You're here with Crypto E. If you guys are new to this channel, then subscribe to this channel with the bell notification so you can be notified every single time I drop information pack videos just like the one you're watching right now. But that being said guys, this video will be specifically targeting how to take a once in a lifetime opportunity that's coming straight to you. How to make some crazy gains I'm talking about 100X plus, 1000X plus gains. By the way, if you don't know how to do the math, that's around 10,000 to, ooh, I like that sunshine, but 10,000 to 100,000%. So how to take advantage of this new crypto or stocks or Forex, whatever drop that we're seeing in the markets and we see a clear drop in the markets. And I'm trying to tell you guys that it's a great opportunity to get into. So how do you take advantage of this drop that we're having in the markets. So the, you know, I'm trying to give you guys the best answer that I can possibly do, because I would like to see everybody succeed at the end of the day, but nonetheless, let's get straight into it. So the first step is when you see the price pull back like this, you should put in money weekly. So even, you know, if you already have positions in the markets, so let me talk strictly about crypto. If you already have positions in the markets, let's say Ethereum for, for instance, and you have, uh, let's say $500 in Ethereum and you bought it when it was around 3,500. So now you can do incremental investment or weekly investment and that's putting in around maybe even $10, $100 a week. I wouldn't think that $10 will make any big impact unless you're investing into low cap altcoins or you know the metaverse tokens. And ApeCoin is a different token that we'll get into. Well, let me take this little to quick left real quick, but. Yeah, to make those crazy amount of gains is the best time to invest in the markets that I believe is Bailey right now. Or anytime you see the market going down, you should invest in it. I'm not saying, you know, keep on buying the dip because there's going to be a point where to you're not going to be able to buy the dip. You can't just keep on buying the dip forever. Do you understand what I'm saying? I'm sure you guys do. So take advantage of what's going on in the markets that we're seeing a dip and you should take advantage of it. So you should, you know, if I was in your position, what I would do is, cause it's not investment advice or at all. But if I was in your position, what I would do is weekly, I would invest into these cryptos or these stocks or any type of investment that you want to invest in because they're slowly dropping. One thing I'm not suggesting is to invest into Netflix. And that's my personal reason. But you know, this is a quick video that I'm making. Stay vigilant in the markets at the end of the day, guys. Don't get beaten up with these markets. They're swinging left and right, but invest a good amount of money right now. And then when it goes back up, you'll see your investment rise. But I'm not saying put everything right now. So if you have a thousand dollars, I'm not saying put a thousand dollars right now. But if you have a thousand dollars to invest, maybe you should put in a hundred weekly because the market can still keep on going low. Be smart with it. So when it keeps going low, invest a little bit. When it goes back up, then wait for it because we're still in a bearish market. Everybody's saying it's a bull market, it's a bull market, but I believe if the bearish market continues to you know, consolidate or go down a little bit for about two to three months, then we're still in a bearish market until we see Bitcoin rise above 50 to $55,000 per one Bitcoin, we're still going to be in the bear market. So stay vigilant guys, I'm not trying to make this a long video, but I really wanted to inform you guys about what's going on in the markets and how you should take your opportunity of once in a lifetime because this is the same thing as 2020. When 2020 happened, everybody was like, yo, everything's gonna crash. We're all gonna die and burn because of COVID. And the smart money was making moves, investing into everything that was done. Bitcoin even hit a low of 3,500. It was 3,580. I remember that to the T. And Ethereum was at $100. XRP was at 20 cents. I can keep on going on and on and on, you know, all these tokens. And even when Shiba came out, it had 10 zeros. Dogecoin was at like two, three zeros. What else can I say? You know, the S&P 500 was around, if I'm not mistaken, it was around like 1,500. 
and the US 30 was around 15,000 or 13,000. And now it's around 33,000. It's over 100% increase in every single market. And you guys know what happened in 2021 when the year started, everything was trending. Bull markets here and there. Everybody saying, we're gonna keep on going bull because the Fed pumped their money at the end of the day, but we can't keep on going up and up forever. There's gotta be a retracement because people would want to sell their positions to liquidate some assets or some cash to buy into some different positions. So just stay vigilant, guys. As I always say, if you guys are new to this channel, then subscribe to this channel. But there is this one opportunity of a lifetime. Nothing will drop like this. So again, be smart with it. Incrementally invest. If you know right now, put in a hundred dollars. Let's just say, for example, and then next week you put in a hundred dollars. If it goes lower, you put in a hundred dollars. And then by the time it goes even to the second week of uh, you know the high that it was last in the previous week, you're already up on your investments. You're averaging it in your cost of investment. So be smart with it. Stay vigilant, guys. I'm Crypto E. We're all trying to be financially successful, financially striving, instead of just being financially stable. So let's get that in the mindset. We're not trying to be financially stable. We're not trying to be stable. We're not trying to be stagnant like these markets and consolidate, going up and down, up and down, not even just bursting through or coming down. If you're financially stable, there will be a point where you will crash and you won't even have enough money to help you out in your financial situation. So be smart with it. I'm Crypto E. I love y'all. See you on the next video. Again, it's a one time, just like 2020, man. There may be a bigger crash coming, so keep some money to the side, but always be smart. When you see things drop, invest in it a little bit if you like as well. But that being said, I'll see you guys on the next video. I'm Crypto E. Next video will be about Kwong. Don't miss that video. Big update coming.